hello to all my friends out there. So I was excited because I came up with a new recipe, a cheap new recipe for uh, macaroni and cheese with bacon. Okay, so why this is important is because really it's a stockpile recipe. If you can come up with really cheap recipes that are kind of like good, you know, if you ever like start running low on money, you wouldn't suffer as much. So what I want to make is some um, more fruit salad. You know, if you have to go to a party or something and, and you have some canned fruit and you have a few things in the stockpile uh, or you just need dinner like me tonight. Okay, this is, um, I had um, pineapple, frozen pineapple. And um, I just defrosted it a minute or two in the uh, microwave. And then one banana. I have, why I'm making this is I have to use my bananas up. And in the freezer, I had mini marshmallows. I wanted to use them the other day uh, for my fruit salad. And then I have, you know, some whipped topping. Uh, that was a disaster with that. I am really soured on that um, spray out kind. Okay, and so I just want to mix this up. And you know, there's a little uh, in my pineapple, that was just canned pineapple. So there's a little pineapple juice that will melt and that will flavor up my um, Cool Whip, which could have been a little bit not so frozen but you know it'll just take me a minute okay so this is gonna be a pretty good fruit salad and um so okay what happened was i bought giant cans of of pineapples so you know because for a dollar and like one of the things you know like giant cans of um tomatoes or pineapple or peaches you can just freeze them and use them uh, later. You know, it doesn't have to be used all in one meal. That's, uh, you know, it doesn't make any sense to buy the small can. Okay, so this is coming along nicely. So this is um, a cheap dessert. Let me taste it. Okay, that's good. You know, it's one of those things you kind of sort of have to use your bananas. Okay, I planned on making gravy, but everything started going wrong. I had my um, grill plugged in and I didn't know it. So I burned, um, I burned plastic onto my flour and I don't think it's safe to eat. So I will just freeze this. And what this really is, is a batch of gravy. Normally, I make the gravy up right then and there, but, you know, I had my little issues. Okay, so now, let me show you. Okay, so I had some broccoli. It could be any kind of, um, it could be any kind of vegetable. Okay, now let me show you my delicious macaroni and cheese with bacon. And if it's, if there's leftovers, I will just freeze it. Ooh, this looks good. So this, I said this was a $2 dinner, but it's really a lot less because one person wouldn't eat the whole thing. Um, I cut the 12 ounce bacon in half and then I used maybe about one third of it. So that's 33 cents worth of bacon. This is like dirt cheap. Let me see if I can get the light a little better. See what I get for bragging about my great camera woman skills. And then, you know, I have a little peach passion tea. Uh, I was actually working a lot today. You know, these, these videos are easy, but when you work a lot, you know, it's not easy to do anything. But, you know, it's easier to get money if you work. <laughs> and then, you know, I have a... Um, sugar and milk, you know, is the best. Uh, this is the 99 cent milk. 
So, okay, so I had some, some really cheap meals this week. I had the, do you remember the uh, macaroni and cheese with chili? That's really cheap. I think this is cheaper. Um, and I had those tacos. Those are about dirt cheap, too. And then I had the top ramen meal. Just scroll down for that. But um, why I like this is because you get tired of eating the same old thing. And the fruit salad is good. Um, so, okay, you guys. God bless you all. And I'll be back. Oh, I'm so mad. Why does this always cut off my food? Well, because I'm not a good camera woman. God bless you all.